Hey everybody, so we have been waiting for updates on Noel Rodriguez Alvarez and there was a press conference about two days ago about how his mom was charged well indicted for murder of Noel. So they're hoping that with this indictment that it will bring her back to in Texas so that way she can be charged with this little boy right here's murder. He has not been found yet. So the mother of Noel Rodriguez Alvarez, a six-year-old Everman boy missing since March and presumed dead has been charged with capital murder. Everman police announced Monday, a Tarrant County grand jury returned an indictment against Cindy Rodriguez Singh, who is believed to have fled the country. She was also charged with two counts of injury to a child and one count of abandoning without the intent to return. Everman Police Chief Craig Spencer told reporters, this is a rewarding part of the investigation where we feel like our work in, in this effort is finally paying off, that we're able to find some justice for Noel and push towards the finish line, he said. But at the same time, it also confirms our biggest fear. Noel was labeled an endangered missing person on March 25th, the same day an Amber Alert went out for his disappearance. Please say Rodriguez Singh, and her husband fled to India with the six of their children soon after law enforcement opened an investigation. Police have not ruled out charges for the husband, Arsh, Arsh Sheep Singh Spencer said. It's been about one year since the last time Noel was seen alive. Please say he was seen at a hospital in October as his mother gave birth to twins. At the time of his disappearance, Rodrigo Singh was known to be abusive towards Noel and witnesses also told police Rodrigo Singh was known to call him evil possessed or having a demon in him. She did not want Noel, who has intellectual disabilities, near her other children, according to police. Every single one of us has had, and I mean, to be honest, still has a glimmer of hope, Spencer said. I would love <clears throat> nothing more than to be wrong on this case. I think the last thing I want is to have a six-year-old boy die at the hands of his mother. I mean, that's not what I want, but that's the facts that we're faced here, and that's what we're looking at, and it's our job to get justice. So, so sad that this is happening so, so often, too, too often, way too often. And here's another article that I'm going to share with you. The mother of a missing little boy has been indicted on capital murder charges. In a news conference today, Everman police told reporters they still have not recovered the body of six-year-old Noel Rodriguez Alvarez, but they believe he died at the hands of his mother, Cindy Rodriguez Singh. She has since fled the country. Candace Sweat has the story. Everman Police Chief C.W. Spencer told reporters his investigators' work is paying off. The Tarrant County Grand Jury 
has indicted Cindy Rodriguez Singh on felony charges, including capital murder. Six-year-old Noel Rodriguez Alvarez was last seen in October of 2022. Over time, the missing persons case for the little boy turned into a death investigation. Noel was never found, but detectives say all roads lead to one conclusion. That's what they've been working on tirelessly for the last six months, is trying to identify any other potential outcomes for this child, all of which have been ruled out, leaving us down to one simple conclusion that he was murdered. In June, Everman police released surveillance photos of Noel's mother, Cindy Rodriguez Singh, his stepfather and siblings as they left DFW for a flight to India. Noel was not in the photos. I did the last thing I want is to have a six-year-old boy die at the hands of his mother. I mean, that's not what I want, but that's the facts that we're faced here with, and that's what we're looking at. Chief Spencer says they're working with federal and international partners on apprehending Singh and having her extradited. Criminal defense attorney Russell Wilson says there have been several successful criminal prosecutions without a body. We're very familiar with autopsies, and those usually provide a wealth of information as it relates to the manner and means or how a death occurred. Uh, but it doesn't mean that you can't proceed on a case without it. Chief Spencer says this is a significant step in what is still a long journey ahead. Make no mistake that our work is not done. We will continue to work towards justice, and we will continue to search for Noel. In Tarrant County, Candace Sweat, NBC5. When more updates come out on Noel's case, I will let you know. Thank you all for watching, and remember to hit that like button, comment below the video, and send some love to Noel. Have a great night. Bye, guys.